Welcome back to MrPorter.com and our series Five Ways to Wear. Today we're going to take a cardigan and I'm going to try and show you five ways to use it as a layering device for five different occasions and looks. For this first look, what I've done is kept it very monochromatic, which kind of gives it a very modern edge. Uh, we've got these Dolce Gabbana pleated front trousers that give it a nice kind of silhouette and then I put it with this very nice McQueen dress shirt it has a couple of wonderful kind of twists it's got this kind of um, waistcoat-esque back on it for an extra detail as well as the, um, the bib front and I think what that does is kind of give you an extra element when you've got the kind of the V of the cardigan we've got it here with these lovely Marnie Oxford shoes uh, with a bit of a a wedge and then obviously your cardigan and then finished off with this lovely asymmetrical Alexander Wang coat that kind of keeps it very modern and pretty edgy really. So with this next look, I've gone for a very relaxed, uh, laid-back tailoring feel. Uh, we have these YMC pinstripe trousers that um, are really comfortable, a nice soft wool, uh, and this rag and bone shirt that's just got this kind of small polka dot detail that gives it an extra edge to it. I've gone here for quite a relaxed, uh, easy navy tie from Drake's to give it that kind of slight formality. Then you've obviously got your cardigan for the layer. And then I decided to go for this pop of kind of vivid green that I think just keeps it fresh and young. Because kind of above all else, I think, you know, this is a very comfortable look. Um, all the elements are kind of soft, unstructured. But I think it, it, it's got a good overall relaxed, formal feel to it. So with this look, I've used the cardigan to take a suit to a much more kind of informal place. We've gone for quite a relaxed uh, kind of short sleeve granddad shirt from James Purse. And I think that teamed with the, the cardigan kind of instead of a kind of a formal shirt and tie is an, it's a nice alternative. I think we've got these quite lovely um, church's shoes that give it a modern take as well and this great Our Legacy suit and I think you know it gives it a really really nice feel to it I mean I think it's not for everyone and I think it can just as easily be worn with a nice white button-down shirt and tie um, if this does feel a little bit too too casual With this look, I kind of wanted to try something a little bit different. Um, and I kind of approached it with a Japanese aesthetic in mind. Uh, so I started off with this uh, acne kind of denim chambray shirt. And these cargo pants from J Brand, which I think are a really nice fit. They're quite tapered at the bottom. And I popped it uh, with this paisley bow tie by Drake's. Obviously you've got the cardigan and these great Heshang kind of cherry loafers with this lovely tassel detail. And finally, I've gone for this uh, tweed jacket by the Japanese designer Beams Plus, which I think actually gives it a very modern kind of professor look. So, I mean, if you're brave enough, it's one, it's one to try. So for my final look today, I wanted to create something that felt quite practical. 
um, and almost ready for the long winter weekends we have fast approaching. I've gone for this Beams Plus shirt uh, It kind of gives us a little pop of colour um, underneath the cardigan. Just a really comfy, relaxed pair of J. Crew uh, dark denim with, a, again, a quite a practical uh, church's shoe. Uh, and then finished off with this wonderful unstructured cashmere coat by Massimo Alba um, that really just kind of gives it a very chic kind of overall look and feel and ready for pretty much any occasion, really. So hopefully here we've shown you the versatility of a cardigan as a layering device. Uh, I think it adds that extra dimension to all these looks and hopefully one or more of them will work for you.